how long is this going to go on with the economy before it just fucking crashes? Like, last night, ne neither of these people wanted to work. No, there's got to be some pain involved, right? For yeah. The, for this younger generation that refuse, like, oh, we're reimagining what it means to be an employee. Like, no, you're just a lazy cunt. That's, yeah, 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 that's yeah, really yeah. what it is. Yeah. They, they act like, uh, uh, it, it's Instagram, right? All they see are results. They never see process. So they think they deserve the same result as everybody else without having to put in any of the effort. Like we, uh, uh, there's certainly wage issues in this country. Uh, when Bill O'Reilly says he painted houses in the summer to pay his way through Harvard, yeah, you're not doing that anymore. No. Not unless you're painting like the fucking Death Star or some shit. Yeah, or right? the White House. Yeah, so uh, good luck with that bullshit. However, people want the result without any of the fucking work now. And that's not how life works. So they have to feel some pain. That's just how it is. Like to stop, if you're a parent, let your kid become homeless. Fuck yeah. them. Like, honestly, fuck them. If they, what do you expect? You're not doing them any favors by continuing to bail them out. Our waitress actually said this last night, because uh, you were like, hey, I want to tip you. Can you run this card mm -hmm. for one drink or whatever it was? And she was like, yeah, I don't really care about money. And I was like, what? What? Um, and then today, the market crashes. What, what's the market down today? It was down 600 when I left the house. It was down 1,000 last time I looked. Are you fucking serious? Mm -hmm. How long can we continue all this well, shit? Well, I mean, look, winter is usually it's a It's down 437.65, the Dow Jones. Okay. Yeah, so it's back up a little bit. It's, back up uh, a little bit, it, yeah. Winter is a volatile time for the market pretty frequently, uh, so I'm not really surprised by any of that. And it's been, uh, a lot of people are freaking out over crypto, too, but crypto has been very volatile in winter months over the last forever. Yeah, We're it's down with. It's down in half. We're bouncing back. <laughs> Ethereum's at 24 right now. Is well, it? Well, it's, it's re it regulates itself, right? I mean, uh, during the beginning portion of a company, especially one that has high volume trading like crypto does, you're going to see big swings, but it'll fucking even. You can draw a straight line across it at about a 3,000 point or percent increase year over year. You yeah, I, mean? I, I look, Ethereum was up to 4,500 at one point. It's almost cut in half. Uh, Bitcoin is right around 43,000, I think, right? Or no, 30, 36 last 36. I looked. So yeah, so it and that was riding was, high at about it was 43 70. last week. Yeah, it was close to 70. Mm. So both of those are, are cut in half. Uh, we were talking about the trucks earlier with this Maverick, the, the new $20,000 truck. Ford just shut off the orders. Yeah. Because they were getting so many. I saw one on the road. Um, They're pieces of shit. It, it, they're, I, no, it's a piece of shit. Like I think it looked nice. Uh, I, <laughs> For a $20,000 truck, it looked pretty goddamn nice. If somebody tells you something and it sounds too good to be true, it is. So I, dig down into what it means for it to be a 20000 truck. Yeah. Uh, the safety shed is down. The, pay, the total payload for this truck and its two-liter uh, uh, four-cylinder engine, mm -hmm. right, which is basically a Honda Accord. Yeah. Not, yeah. No shit, that's a Honda Accord engine and a truck. The payload is 1,500 pounds. For a twenty thousand dollar vehicle, that's not bad. Yeah, but you're, it, that's like buying an airsoft gun. It hey, doesn't bro. do what a truck does. So don't call it. Is, they can call it anything but a truck. It's not a truck. Fifteen hundred pounds is a decent amount. No, it's not. Yeah, dude. it's it's not. That's terrible. For a small pickup no. truck, it's fine. No, um, but it's uh, you know they took the unusual step of canceling the orders until twenty twenty three. You're clearly selling the fuck out of these things. So yeah. like. High and Angry says it's like the old five-speed Ford Ranger. Yeah, but like with the normal body size of a truck. Yeah. So, yeah, all the internal shit from a Ford Ranger, but on a, like an F-150 body. It's, it's about, let's, I, I, saw, I saw one on the road a couple of days ago. It's, it looks like the size of a Tacoma-ish, somewhere in there. Um, but, uh, yeah, for 20 grand shit, uh, it's better than having a RAV4, you know? I don't know what that is. A RAV4? Yeah. What do you think I rap for? Did you push a fucking RAV4? It's just a, you know, like a Kia Soul. Mm. It looks like a Kia Soul. But um, with these Mavericks, it looked pretty decent. And like, you know, shit. If you're just trying to, to make, it, make it buy on a $20,000 pickup truck, pretty goddamn good deal. Yeah. Why would you cut that off? Um, everything else that's going on here, like, dude, it, 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 I don't know how much longer the economy can take all of this. There's got to be a collapse at some point. Yeah. I Everything mean, is empty. Every fucking store we go to, there's help wanted signs. 
What's why? We need to have. What's gonna happen? We need to have an uh, like a public economics debate where two the two guys debating are stuttering really badly. Right? Mer, mer, like yeah. you're using slurs, but you never get to the end of the slur, so nobody can actually <laughs> prove you've said anything. Like fe, 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 fe. and nobody ever gets there. No. I think honestly, that's that's like uh, 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 that's cover. That's mm-hmm. a bulletproof vest. For calling people racial slurs, basically. Yeah. I mean, if you're into that, and we are, hey, uh, get to it. Start stuttering, folks. It worked for Joe Biden. <laughs> Hell, he's, he just says retarded shit over and over. He's like, oh, I developed a stutter back in the 70s. Like, God dude, you, it, we dude. have 80 years of television from you. Yeah. You haven't stuttered once. No, no. You piece of shit. Uh, Caesar Max says Jimmy from South. It's a little bit like a cripple fight, yeah. Hey, a little bit. A little bit of cripple fight in yeah. it. Uh, Jim Kramer saying not to panic. But we are in the white knuckle zone. <laughs> Jim Cramer saying not to panic. <laughs> if Jim Cramer knew anything, he wouldn't be on TV. He would be making money on his investments. He's getting, by the way, he's getting torched for, uh, on January 5th, he said to buy Netflix. Huge buy. Netflix has dropped about 25%. Yeah. Um, man, all these companies, these streaming companies have overspent on money, mm-hmm. trying to keep up with the Joneses. I, I know Netflix is in you know, a couple billion in debt. Uh, all these companies, man, it's just, uh, it feels like a super bubble is what they're calling it. Mm. I just don't know when it's going to burst. I don't know if that's accurate or not. I mean, this isn't too unlike what we've seen twice before in the last 20 years. People just are, now they're social media, right? During that 2008-9 crash, Mm -hmm. it was like there were some people on Twitter, but for the most part, people were just experiencing it in their daily lives, which means... They were having trouble with housing and shit. Yeah. People were losing their homes and stuff like that, and those people could feel it, but everybody else is just like, all right, I'm hearing about this crash, but I'm not really feeling anything. Now people are way more, like the average person is way more invested in the market now than ever before, whether it's through new stock trading, new crypto, or because they're taking uh, uh, part of great programs like Roth IRAs and putting money in that's untaxable and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Uh, I just think there's more exposure now than there was before. For the individual, so people are hyping it up more. But I don't know if the circumstances are that much different. Well, with inflation and uh, you know what is it? Inflation's at the highest in forty years right now. Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know how much longer people can take of this. Um, we'll I mean, see. I mean, you're you're getting like fucking uh, the McDonald's by my house is like I think eighteen dollars an hour. That's, uh, yeah, that's crazy, yeah. dude. I've seen a bunch of. Uh, help wanted posters around Austin. It's like twenty five an hour, like for an entry level job. Yeah, which yeah. is interesting. I mean that that shit uh, permeates through the entire economy. You know what I mean? So there's these there are these these uh, 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 metrics for uh, local economic uh, production. So typically, a dollar spent in a local economy will multiply seven to eleven times before it expands out into the state or federal economy, right? Yeah. People that, uh, if you go to mom and pop stores, chances are more likely that they're getting their their source materials and their employment uh, from people that live there. Now, a lot of this tech stuff, people live all over the place. Mm -hmm. So you have, it's almost like uh, like a federal globalization almost because the... The impact of of buying locally now is diffused over the entire country because people live all the fuck over the place. So the economy is changing. That doesn't necessarily mean it's going to crash. We'll yeah. see. I, I mean, it may. I'm not saying it won't. I'm just saying there's uh, a lot going on. Tons, man. And uh, I'll you know definitely keep my eye on it. But Jesus Christ, dude, it's it's getting bleak out there. Grocery stores are getting worse and worse. Yeah. Uh, more and more empty. Um, there's a fucking guy over in Ireland who got, uh, he's dead. He died and they dragged him into a post office to collect his pension, which is fucking awesome. Well, dude. yeah, I mean, look, it takes uh, a few weeks to get a death certificate. 